Now I've been testing many wearables on this channel, which means that all my activities and workouts are spread across different company apps and bringing them all to Strava means that I can keep track of my activities and workouts in one single place. Now, I've been testing the Amazfit BIP5 and I wanted to show you a way that can help you sync your Zep app to Strava so you can keep track of your activities in one place as well. The first step here is to open the Zep app on your phone and then select profile in the bottom right corner. Scroll down and click on third party account linking and now you can see all external services you can link the Zep app to. Select Strava and then you'll see here that the app says Unbound, meaning that the Zep app and Strava are not linked to each other. Next, select Unbound and the app will open a browser where you'll be asked to log into Strava if you haven't and then authorize the Zep app to upload your activities recorded on Amazfit devices to Strava. Next, select Authorize and then you'll be taken back to the Zep app where now you can see your username appear here and the Zep app will now sync your activities from Amazfit wearables to Strava in the background. Now, if you wanted to remove the link between Strava and the Zep app for whatever reason, all you need to do is go back into third-party account linking, then select Strava and then select revoke authorization, at which point you'll see this deauthorized message at the bottom. And that's how you sync the Zep app to Strava. Now, if you're thinking of buying the Amazfit BIP5 or if you already own one, make sure you check this video out, which is my full in-depth review of the Amazfit BIP5 and this video where I show you 9 pro tips to master your Amazfit BIP5. See you in the next one.